Two local lads, John Moody from Rayleigh, just up the road on the right, and Lenny Hard, born in Jamaica, but now comes from Chelmsford, also not far from here. So Moody, the defending Southern Area champion, meeting again the man he stopped in six rounds at Bethnal Green in February. And that was a fight we also saw on Grandstand. Moody from Rayleigh with a lot of Welsh blood in him. Moody will be 26 early next month. Howard is 27. Howard on the right. Howard, the man looking for revenge. And looking for revenge against the only man who's ever stopped him. Stamina and the strength of Moody carried the day last time in what was a very hard and uh, remorseless fight. And Howard is starting it, this one, much the same way as he started that one with the skillful left hand poking up. But in the end, it was Moody's strength that told. for a brisker start to what may be a 10-round fight if he goes the distance. The match made at 12 stone 7, the light heavyweight limit. Moody 12, 5 and a half. And Howard just four ounces heavier. defending this southern area title for the first time. He stopped Howard in six rounds at Bethnal Green, and the man who stopped the fight was uh, the famous referee, Harry Gibbs, who was refereeing his last fight that night, and he stepped in when Moody went into attack, having had Howard down for a count of nine. Are we gonna see history repeat itself tonight? Second out, round two. John Moody on the right comes from a boxing family. His great uncle was the famous Frank Moody, former British middle and light heavyweight champion back in the 1920s. The Moody's a great Welsh fighting family. Been many of them over the years. And this is the latest addition to the family. jumped up too quickly. I think he needed a longer count than that. And we're only just over a minute into this second round. Howard will do well to recover from this. Again, 
the left. Everything coming at hard. The boxing wits of hard have been scattered. Doesn't know where to go for safety. Desperate moments for the challenger. The legs are still very weak. That's the left again. That was the one that did the damage. And again, he's very near to being beaten hard. And he's hanging on and he had to go over. He tried to hang on and he couldn't stay upright. And Hard's giving himself a couple of punches to bring himself round. And I think it's been stopped. It's all over. Larry O'Connell, referee, and he's a good referee. He knows the game. He pulled Howard out of it. Howard couldn't stand up. If it hadn't been for Moody propping him up, he'd have gone down earlier. That's a sensational win by Moody. He took six rounds to beat uh, Howard in a very, very tough fight last time. And this time he's found the punch in the second round that has brought him success. Well, it all happened with a tremendous swinging left hand very early in this second round. Here we are. That's the one. Oh on the side of the jaw and over went Lenny Howard and he never really properly recovered from that because Moody didn't give him a chance to recover he just went in and piled in punch after punch after punch until finally Larry O'Connell decided to call it a day when Howard just couldn't keep his feet. And still